Well hello there, this is El Skipper and today I will try to tackle the giant subject that is Weapon Core and mods that use it. Hopefully after this video you will understand the subject better and that will help you in finding one of the best mods out there. Please enjoy. Weapon Core is a complete rewrite of Space Engineer's combat system. It completely changes how everything works. The mod that you can find, a link in the description, isn't actually adding anything. It's just a framework for everything else. There are a lot of mods based on Weapon Core because before the Warfare update, it was the best that the community had. To this day, many people prefer this mod over the vanilla update. But are the weapons from other mods with this framework any good? Let's take a look at some of them. I will start with MWI Weapon Collection 1. This mod adds to your game 17 different weapons that you can use. You can easily find something like an M1 torpedo for sniping other ships or the perfect weapon for the big battleship in a way of a battleship cannon. This mod focuses mostly on big arsenal. Only 4 from dot 17 weapons are available in the small grid version. It means that this mod may not come handy when building something small and agile, but will perform great when building a giant capital ship. To be honest, the shot from the weapon that changed night to day caught me by surprise, which shows how much fun you can have with this mod. The second mod is from the same creator and it's called MWI Weapon Collection 2. You can easily call this the second iteration of MWI weapons. This time the focus is set to energy weapons. Your armaments don't need any other ammo than energy. This has the downside of needing the constant energy consumption for some weapons and for some others needing it in a burst. They are more focused on shooting one place instead of doing splash damage. Just keep that in mind. In it you will find 8 different weapons, with most of them having only big grid variations, so this pack like the last one is mostly made for those huge battleships, star destroyers and bases. I do like this one because sometimes creating ammo for your weapons can be a chore, and needing only energy cuts it in half. Next on the list is again MWI, and I know, I know, we had it enough, but this time it adds homing weaponry. And this is rather a small mod that can be useful for even for tiny builds. The mod adds 4 different homing missile blocks that can be very important in your fighting vehicle. They have an amazing range with the M1 torpedo launcher having a whopping 10 km of effective distance reach. They are an amazing tool for protecting your ship against anything that will even come close. Of course they have a big downside with the possibility of enemy weapons shooting them down and time to travel until they reach their target. Even with those downsides it can be a very cost effective weapon. The next mod on the list is called RX Weapon Enterprises and this is a huge one. Because this mod alone adds 33 different weapons to the game. Showing even some of them in this video is almost impossible so I won't go into detail. This mod is very poly. The textures are visually pleasing, the sound is perfect and the possibilities are endless. You can find weapons ranging from simple kinetic cannon to laser and torpedoes and ending with support blocks that can use EMPs. On the plus side, every weapon has its ammo type, range and what type of damage it does written in the description of it, so you don't have to scavenge for information about that. Overall, I would say it's one of the best, if not the best, weapon core mod that you can find. Bringing us closer to the end, we have weapon core replaced vanilla weapons. This is just a simple fix that makes all of our old vanilla weapons compatible with weapon core, so they are getting the ability to shoot down torpedoes and work with system that weapon core provided. I would recommend using this mod every time you play with Weapon Core, simply because you may sometimes forget that you have vanilla weapons and they may not react to Weapon Core missile. Last but not least we have our good friend Defensive Shield mod. This isn't adding any new weapons to our game, instead it adds the way of defending yourself with an energy shield that you may know from sci-fi universes. For the cost of energy you are getting a shield that will protect you as long as it can or as long as you have energy. You can specialize it in being more durable against different types of damage, customize its color, shape, size. Very useful, especially with many more deadly weapons floating around the space. If you still want to know more, I recommend checking out my explaining in 5 minutes or less, where I try to explain how exactly this mod works in about 5 minutes. So that would be all, thank you guys for watching and... Wait, what is this? I don't understand, what is this thing? B -b -b bonus Ha! So that wasn't all, we do have one bonus mod which is called NPC Weapon Upgrades and this isn't a Weapon Core mod, 
this one just adds, adds simply an option for all of the AI grids to have different weapons from the weapon mods that you are going to use. So even if you are using the MWI or the RX Enterprises, your NPCs can have those weapons. Just be careful because this is not balanced at all. They are getting weapons at random. So just I will tell you right now. But if you want a bit more challenge, I recommend checking this mod out. So now that would be all. Thank you guys for watching. Check out my other videos. If you didn't know, I started the Elden Ring series. So uh, I recommend checking it out. And thank you for watching and I see you in the next one. Bye.